What is up guys? Welcome to another video today. Uh, if you're wondering why all my other videos, uh, I took all my other videos down because another one of my videos got copyright striked, which my, my Promise Neverland Volume 2 review. So now I'm on two strikes and I showed all and basically all my other videos. I didn't want to get copyright striked again, otherwise the channel would have been taken down. But I didn't just want those videos to be gone, so I decided I'll just redo all of them without showing any art. Only the cover and the back and the spine. And that should be okay. So yeah, and it's, I guess it's kind of a blessing in disguise. I can try with this new background and see what you guys think before I get into any brand new videos. Uh, so yeah, I should be just re-uploading everything before the haul next week or maybe two weeks from now. I'm just waiting for one package from Book Depository with one volume. And one from Amazon that has two volumes in it. Uh, this, shouldn't, this shouldn't take too long this video. I'm just... Uh, re-uploading it, or not re-uploading it, redoing it so the only change is that I guess my opinion of the series will kind of change considering I've read more than I had the first time I made the first impressions but don't worry in this case it's only changed my this series for the better I can tell you this is probably my second favourite manga going at the moment uh, versus Naruto so yeah I absolutely love this one more thing just before I get into the uh, series itself is uh, because this channel's on two strikes, I wanted to just make sure that none of these videos, like, so basically I made a new channel, and I'll link it in the description below, and I'm just going to be uploading all the same videos, because I think it'll most likely come to a point where I don't want to get a third strike, especially on this channel where I, like, I watch all the other YouTube videos and stuff, and this is what I use every day, so I just start uploading manga videos on the other channel, so just for now I'll be uploading the same videos on both channels, just so when I do make the transition over to the other channel. Right, sorry about, about that guys. So yeah, when I do make the transition over to the other channel. It will be pretty smooth and all my videos will still already be up there. So I'll link that in the description below. I'd really appreciate if you subs could subscribe. Because one or two scenarios might happen. I might get another copyright strike in one video. But I'll try my hardest not to. In that case I'll just keep on uploading manga videos on that channel. But the most likely scenario is I just don't really want to risk it on this channel anymore so I'll move over to that channel and just continue uploading manga videos on there but if that were the case I would definitely tell you guys I'll make a video about it so after the haul it's likely that will happen but I give it a couple of videos so you guys can go over and subscribe there and uh, hopefully you guys continue to watch my videos when that time comes uh, so without further ado, let's just get into this. I've been talking for long enough. So yeah, before we even get into it, I can already tell you this is a series I highly recommend. If you like getting into manga, it's a good series. It's only four volumes out at the moment. So it's definitely one that wouldn't be too long to get into or too rough. It only costs you about £28 for all four volumes, and that's at retail price. Which you should never really buy manga at retail price anyway. But yeah, a brief synopsis on the story is that these are kids who are orphans in an orphanage and uh, everything's kind of cutesy and nice within the first few chapters they're just kind of building the world up and the uh, area from the kids perception which I think is quite good uh, and then it takes a darker turn and you realize everything in the house is not as it seems which is quite interesting and uh, it's kind of how our three characters but protagonists Emma, Ray and Norman have to deal with those consequences of finding out the secrets or issues within the house or even within the outside world one, story, one thing I can say about this is it's definitely a unique concept definitely something that's brand new and not, nothing really seen before it's uh, definitely one of his media's series of I think came out started coming out in 2017 so it's definitely that's my opinion their series of the year for last year uh, the new concept that it brings in it's uh, amazing the character progression is reasonably so in this first volume, but it definitely does pick up in the later uh, volumes of the series, especially when deaths start to happen. But um, yeah, I definitely recommend this series. I can't really say too much about it. I really love it. I'll be redoing my volume reviews for the next three volumes, which you can see in the background, uh, just without showing any art, like I said. But yeah, definitely recommend this series. The high, I'd, if I was you, I'd put it on the high top of your priority list and it's definitely a really good series so yeah if you guys are, are like this first 
re kind of remake of a video. Next video I'll be doing is Astro Lost in Space first impressions. And then after that I think it's Hunter X Hunter first impressions maybe. Or maybe the first almost never done volume, I'm not sure. I'll need to have a look. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll leave the link to the other channel in the description. Peace.